So we got the uh, three wing T33 T80 conversion with a eight pan fan, smaller tailpipe, no cheater hole and modified ducting. Want me to zoom at all? Can't really see it. It's pointing right here. That's why the flaps don't stay. Yeah, I thought that was kind of a weird spin it was doing. Going ballistic. So in terms of flying qualities compared to a stock T-33, uh, it's pretty similar. The, um, the visual's smaller. Yeah, it looks a lot smaller in the air. No tanks on it. Uh, one thing I found that was interesting on lighting is that the pitch doesn't change with the throttle as much with the cheater hole covered up. Uh, way back on power, I'm, this is half power right here. Like I said, this is an A10 fan, so it's got a little less power than a stock one, but it still goes pretty nice. The only bummer is it doesn't my fedge as good as the T33, but it'll probably get better with tip tanks on it. But uh, let me come around this side and do my fedge for you guys. It definitely has a much cleaner look in the air. Full power. Quite as good as the T33. We don't have the canopy giving lift either. Well, you can see it's not hurting too bad for performance. It's got a pretty neat sound to it. This man's probably a little bit starved, but it's not too bad. So we'll do a speed break. Full flap slow pass here. I did take it up and stall it. It's pretty benign. It does drop a wing, but not until you're really slow. Here at these lower speeds, the fan's a little bit stalled, but once it's moving, it's going pretty good. Crosswind's picking up. Yeah, we're flying at almost 4,500 feet up here, and it's a warm day. So, thin air. This is a uh, Roaring Top 5045C. That's a very pretty good stuff. Right. It does have some small teeter holes inside the wheel wells, which help at low speeds. There's a lot of whoosh sound coming out. That's the fans not real thrilled right now because of the 
lack of a cheater hole, but once it's moving, it works pretty well. The line's pretty slow. Uh, it is quite a bit lighter than a stock T33. All right, so there you have it, the little flight with the uh, P80. Um, not much changed. I ended up putting a little bit of down trim in it. I had some, had a little bit of up in it before. Now the elevator is completely neutral. Um, yeah, overall I think it flies pretty good. It's, you can tell it's real clean in the air. It'll cruise around at real low power settings. Um, you just shot inside the ducting here. It's kind of hard to see, but. Definitely opened up from stock. So, pretty happy with it. Uh, it lands really nice. Not that the T33 didn't land nice, but uh, I noticed that the throttle settings would really affect pitch before with the cheater hole. And now, before I was almost neutral on the stick with power on coming into land, and now I'm finding that I'm actually holding up on it so it's a different uh, technique to land it I'm still getting used to it but uh, anyways pretty happy with it now it's time to fix her all up and give her a nice paint job we'll see you next time